Okay, students, now we are going to attempt next numerical example, 8.4. Statement is a pipe has a length of 1 meter. Determine the frequency of the fundamental and the first two harmonics. A. If the pipe is open at both ends. B. The pipe, if the pipe is closed at one end. And given the speed of sound in air is 340 meter per second. The solution of this numerical example can be written as solution so first we will write out given data we have given length which is l as 1 meter and the second thing is mentioned there speed of sound v 340 meter per second okay students we have given these two things and uh, another thing is given as a condition the condition they have, we have given two conditions first condition is that we have to find out the two frequencies f1 fundamental frequency and f2 in both those two cases number one a is given as if the pipe is open if the pipe pipe is open at both ends अगर हमारे पास pipe जो है दोनों ends से open है तब जो है इसका solution हमने निकालना है कि हमने इसकी fundamental frequency f1 find out करनी है और f2 जो है इसकी second harmonic frequency जो है find out करनी है let's find out we know that when our pipe is open at both ends then the uh, harmonic series of frequencies we have how can we find out kar sakte we know that fundamental frequency for this say f1 should be equal n v over 2l okay students here n is the number of harmonic series and we can take for first then we can take n as 1 multiply and we have given v which is speed of sound 340 and 2 multiply by length l when you solve this you will have frequency 170 hertz this is the first no this is first note frequency this is the first harmonic frequency fundamental frequency you can find out the f2 as 2f1 because जब हमने ये पढ़ा था इनके बारे में जब हमने stationary waves के अंदर जो था हमने जब हमने अपने organ pipe के अंदर number of frequencies जो series of frequencies थी harmonic series of frequencies उसमें हमने पढ़ा था कि हमारे पास जब हमारा pipe जो है organ pipe जो है दोनों तरफ से जब वो open होगा तब हमारे पास जो fundamental frequency का formula था हमने ये drive out किया था और सेकेंड फ्रीक्वेंसी हमारे पास फर्स्ट फंड फ्रीक्वेंसी जो है हमारे पास यानी फंडामेंटल फ्रीक्वेंसी का टू टाइम होती है इसी तरह थर्ड है यानी एन वन है तो फर्स्ट है एन टू है तो सेकेंड फ्रीक्वेंसी है तो जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई टू फाइंड आउट द एफ टू यू हैव यू विल हैव टू जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई टू बाय फर्स्ट फ्रीक्वेंसी मीन टू से वन सेवेंटी विच इज अ फंडामेंटल फ्रीक्वेंसी नॉट फर्स्ट फ्रीक्वेंसी सो इन दिस वे यू कैन हैव थ्री फोर्टी Hertz. Okay, so this is a condition when the pipe is open at both ends. Now, the second condition is B. If the pipe is closed at one end, the second if the pipe is closed at वन एंड यानी कि हमारा जो पाइप है वो एक तरफ से वो क्या हो बंद हो देन वी नो दैट द फंडामेंटल फ्रीक्वेंसी नॉट फार्मूला एन वी ओवर फोर एल वैल्यू सब्सिट्यूट करते हैं एफ वन एन इज वन वी इज थ्री फोर्टी एंड फोर L is one. So in this way, 
you can have first fundamental frequency okay here uh, उसे यहाँ पे जो थर्ड फ्रीक्वेंसी भी दी है क्योंकि उसमें टू फ्रीक्वेंसी का कहा था तो थर्ड फ्रीक्वेंसी अगर फाइंड आउट करना चाहें तो हम थर्ड फ्रीक्वेंसी भी जो है वो निकाल सकते हैं यू जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई बाय थ्री बाय वन सेवेंटी सो इन थ्री जीरो जीरो दिस इज फाइव टेन हर्ड दिस इज दर्ड नोट ऑफ फ्रीक्वेंसी ओके हे वी आर गोइंग टू फाइंड आउट वेन आवर फर्स्ट This is 85. This is 85 uh, hertz. This is the first node. Now we are going to find out the second. For two, we will just multiply. You just multiply by F1 by two to find out the second node frequency. This should be five twos are ten one carry a to the sixty and seventy. Now in this way you can find third node. Just three f one three multiplied by eighty five. So three fives are fifteen one carry three eights are twenty four and twenty five. So in this way you can find out the third node of frequency okay i forgot that okay now the second condition is given if the pipe is closed at one end as soon we know that fundamental frequency for this formula when the power organ pipe is closed at one end which is given f1 is equal to n v over 4l now substituting the values n is 1 v is a 340 4 multiplied by L, which is given as 1. Now in this way, F1 is 85 hertz. This is the first node when our organ pipe is closed at one end. Now the second node. In case we know that when our pipe is uh, closed at one end, then you can uh, find out the second node, which is the odd frequencies, odd series of harmonic series of frequencies. So the odd one. Next is three. This is three into F one. So it should be three fives are fifteen. One carry three eights are twenty four and one twenty five. This is the second odd frequency when our organ pipe is closed at one. And now the third odd frequency. F five is five F one five multiplied by eighty five 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 is a twenty five and two carry five eights are forty and two forty two this is five twenty four twenty five hertz. So in this way you can solve this numerical example which is uh, important according to paper point of view. पेपर पॉइंट के लिए आसे इंपॉर्टेंट भी है इसलिए आप लोगों ने इसे जरूर अटेम्प्ट करना है ओके स्टूडेंट नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व नेक्स्ट मेरिकल एग्जांपल 8.5 अ ट्रेन इज अप्रोचिंग आ स्टेशन एट 90 किलोमीटर पर आवर साउंडिंग अ विसल ऑफ फ्रीक्वेंसी 1000 हर्ट्ज व्हाट विल बी द अपरेंट फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ द विसल एज हर्ड बाय अ लिसनर सिटिंग ऑन द प्लेटफार्म व्हाट विल बी द अपरेंट फ्रीक्वेंसी हर्ड बाय द सेम लिसनर इफ द ट्रेन मूव्स अवे From the station with the speed, speed of sound is given 340 meter per second. Okay, students, we have to find out two frequencies. First, apparent frequency when the train is moving towards the listener observer, and the second frequency, apparent frequency when the train starts moving away from the listener. So, to solve this numerical example, solution will be. first we will write out given data frequency source source frequency we can write this source frequency as uh, mentioned at your textbook is f not you can write this f 
1000 hertz second thing is given as speed of source or you can say that this is speed of sound 340 meter per second and other thing is given as speed of the train source to this is given as 90 kilometer per hour first we will convert this 90 kilometer per hour to meter per second for this sake we will multiply by 1000 and divide by 3600 we know that one hour contains 60 minutes 60 seconds when, when you multiply 60 by 60 then you will have 360 okay by solving this we will have 25 meter per second when you solve this you can have 25 meter per second this is the speed of source okay students the apparent frequency let's say we will have to find out the f dash and f dash double dash this is the frequency this is the apparent frequency when the train is moving towards is approaching on the station and this is the frequency when is uh, train when train is uh, uh, departing okay and when train is moving away from the station or you can say when the train is uh, moving away from the observer or listeners so first we can see this should be v over v minus mu s into f you will have to just substituting the values 340 340 25 and this is 1000 just substituting the values and you will have frequency apparent change in frequency is 1079.4 hertz now let's find out the frequency when the train when train is moving away from the source um, we set this frequency as double dash this is v over v plus mu s into f so substituting the value when you solve this you can find out the uh, value which is 931.5 931.5 hertz you can see that when the train is approaching towards the listener apparent change frequency is 1079.4 hertz and when the train is moving away from the source then the apparent change frequency 931.5 or you can 931.5 hertz up dekh sakte hain you can say there is a quite difference between these two frequencies this is the apparent change which is uh, uh, find out found by uh, dopplers and in this way we can estimate whether the source is approaching or moving away